right, Billy, moving on to topic three. I don't know how long this conversation will go, but I wanted to talk to you about Battle Royales. Hey, the Fortnites, the Call of Duty Black Ops 4s, Blackout Mode, the PUBGs, which I don't think you ever played. Um, you used to be into them. Yeah. Was there a certain, like, what, what made it die off for you, I guess? <laughs> I just felt like I was doing... I don't know. I'm just, it's going to sound weird when I say it because I like playing COD. Mm -hmm. But I first felt like I was doing the same stuff all the time. Especially with Fortnite. Like I would just land, I'd get my guns, and I'd get fucked up. Oh, uh, okay. I'd land, and then I'd get my shit, and then get fucked up. Okay. Um, so that's why kind of Fortnite, I wasn't really into it. Mm -hmm. um, just because I didn't really like the building aspect of it. Right. I got a little bit good at it, but not like well enough to compete or be able to do well or anything, but enough to maintain and survive, I guess. Yeah. But I don't know. It took took away i really love the idea of it though mm -hmm. like fortnite's world is crazy and all the stuff you can do and all the places and all the intricate little things they have i think that's really cool mm -hmm. and just the randomization of it like of you know finding whatever you're gonna find yeah but i don't know i just kind of lost interest in them mm -hmm. apex too apex yeah, interest in them. now do you think it would be better if you played with people or no? i think it would definitely help a lot more if i played with people mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I would also need to be in the mood for them too because if I want to play with people, I usually just go on COD and play with them. And gotcha. We'll grind it out. Yeah. I remember one weekend back at uh, this past semester at Cortland, me and Connor played uh, a double XP weekend mm -hmm. of Call of Duty, and that was after after I transferred and whatnot. So like I didn't, there was nothing, there's really no point left in the Cortland semester. So I was just hanging around, yeah, doing the whatnots, and uh, we went twenty three and two on the weekend of Call of Duty. Nice. Yeah, so that was just fun. Mm -hmm. But uh, yeah, I think the the group I think together yeah. helps it a lot more. Just because then you guys can like call out coordinates, you can say who's who's what, where's where, and it just it mm -hmm. feels more fun. I guess you could say. Yeah, whenever um the three of us were able to hook up for Apex, Dio, you and I, mm -hmm. I always had a great time yeah. with that. Especially too, because just wonky things happen sometimes. Yeah. With them. <laughs> yeah. Like I'll just get lit up or something, or like somebody will scare shit out of you, and you'll just get spooked, and you can have that initial reaction where yeah. if you're playing with nobody, and that happens. It's just you're like, oh. Mm -hmm. But then it's over. Yeah, I think there's a clip on Twitch actually. I think I was playing with you. I don't think I was playing with you. It might have been Nolan instead. We landed on the the ship because mm -hmm. <laughs> we're dumb. Mm -hmm. I think Nolan wanted to go. There's like, oh fuck, here we go. <laughs> so they fell mm -hmm. i got a gun and ran off that motherfucker so i was trying to kind of circumvent because they had crawled down and i could revive them so i was trying to circumvent around and i just went whoop right off the map on top of a cliff i was like fuck <laughs> <laughs> not handled well yep no not my best moment um they are fun though they are yeah they are, they, they have some good times to them mm-hmm I've had some fun fun Fortnite matches. Yeah. But, I don't know, I did its time, did its crime, you know, mm -hmm. and then I moved on, I guess. Mm. <laughs> yeah, that's something I'd like to do. I mean, I keep talking about it. I want to play them more. Not necessarily to get good, but just because, like you said, they are fun to do. Um, I think Fortnite has held my attention the most just because of the chapters or seasons whatever yeah. just like the unlockable part yeah. and i know blackout they definitely do too. it the best yeah and modern warfare has a battle pass too oh do they yeah mm -hmm. they didn't play i didn't buy it mm. it looked nice and they also did a nice thing where like every now and then you get like tokens for a double xp or double weapon xp or something you can yeah unlock. but i mean because i didn't have wi-fi for like half the half the winter break i was like oh, i'm not gonna get it mm -hmm. but i might get the next one i don't know okay but they do it like uh they have a, a battle pass each year, or like each one, and it's just like Fortnite though, I've, they did it a lot better that you don't really need to buy it if you don't want to buy it, mm -hmm. but there are a lot of cool cosmetics that you can get if you do want to buy it, and weapon unlocks and whatnot. And there are guns that you can unlock, but everybody unlocks them rather than just the people who have a battle pass. Oh. Okay. So we got like three new guns this this battle pass, if, we, if she gets there at that point. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so I think Fortnite just has pulled me in the most. Yeah, I, I know, think their battle pass is the best. I know Kate and I always, whenever season starts, like, obviously we don't play to win. We usually do the respawn mode, mm -hmm. and we'll just play that and yeah. do the challenges. Um, but when there's not challenges, it's like, <sighs> what's what's the point here? Um, mm -hmm. 
And I definitely felt that early on, like, when you said you would fall, you get shot immediately. Like, yeah, that definitely um, sucks, and there's no motivation to play. Um, yeah, there's nights where you hop in, and it's just not going for it, and you're like, oh, God. Yeah, and I think I haven't played many of the other ones in a while, specifically Apex or Blackout. Those are the ones I played the most out of, like, the plethora besides Fortnite. Yeah. Um, Fortnite, I've kept playing, and I've started going solo mode. I think it's gotten, I don't want to say easier, because that sounds weird, but it has. <laughs> they've, a- I don't know if they've added bots, or there's always been bots. I think they added bots. Okay. A new portion of bots. So they've added bots in, and then it seems like they kind of group you together in people of your skill set. Yeah. So. They do do uh, SPMM, mm. skill-based matchmaking, mm, because everybody complains go. about that on Twitter. Mm. Because all the good people, they're just always going against other good other people. Other good people, And they yeah. never have, like, a nice, relaxing game. Yeah. Set. If you could, like... Switch that setting. Mm-hmm. I think that could be better. Like yeah. for me, obviously. Because they do that in COD too. Oh, they did. Okay. Like I'll get like we'll go on like a four or five game win streak, and then we'll just go against like an entire team that's all one fifty five mm. and like maybe one forty something. We're like level ninety, level eighty nine, level one hundred and five or whatever. Hmm. And then it'll just be like a you know butt clenching game. You're just always like in domination. They're just always taking flags back as soon as we take one back. And it's yeah. just because they do it in that one too, but see, I mean, pers- I don't think it's a big deal. But like, if you could switch it off, that'd mm-hmm. be good. Yeah, personally, I think I like that because if I'm confident or competent in a game, I want to have a, challenge, a solid yeah. game. Yeah. Like Overwatch, I love Overwatch so mm-hmm. much when it's back and forth and like mm-hmm. it's intense. And you know, when we played that together, like sometimes it gets really involved. Sometimes it's a <laughs> clean sweep. Either we're doing really well or we get, and it's like, fuck. And like I mentioned with Fortnite, and you did too, like, it's not motivating to just get bodied over and over again. Yeah. The same could be saying for fighting games. Like, if yeah. they had that in fighting games, which I think they do in ranked, <laughs> um, you know, you want to play more because you're actually doing something. Even if you mm. lose, you felt like yeah. I participated at least. Yeah, like, when we're, usually when we lose, like, I'll still be on the, like, top of our team. Leader, exactly. I'm like, yeah, well, I did fine. But yeah. Like, we just got body, or these guys were just a little bit better than our supporting cast or whatnot. Right. Yeah. So, with Fortnite doing the skill-based and doing the bots, like, lately, I've been feeling I've done much better, Mm -hmm. and I I finally, finally got my first solo win, and it was funny. I've been trying to do it on stream, do it on stream. Two matches off stream, one random night, I got it. I was like, all right, cool. But I finally got that. I know a lot of people who are watching this are like, you got, you got like 30 plus or more. Mm-hmm. Whatever. Um, but every time I do play it now, like, I have five plus kills each match. And, like, I pretty consistently make it top 20 area. Yeah. You know? So, like, that feels better. Mm-hmm. And you mentioned the building, too. Like, if it gets down to those final couple and I see building, like, all right, just got to play patient here and hope for the best. Yep. <laughs> yeah. Because, um, yeah, I mean, I get that it's a tool, but, like, I, I don't know. It's not my thing. I'll use it to get up somewhere or whatever, but now I'm not going to sit there and just rotate my wheel and build everything around me or whatever. Mm-hmm. Um, so, yeah, Fortnite's been a lot, of, a lot more fun, I would say, with that, them adding the bots and adding the the skill-based part. Um, Blackout was one that I want to get into more. Um, now that I have the, the router out here, I want to hardwire my PlayStation and see if that helps, because that definitely helped with Fortnite. Not that it was running shitty. It was just every once in a while, whoop, little blip or whatever. Yeah. Um, and I actually popped in the other night and played, like, one match, and I got a kill. I was like, whoa! <laughs> and then I died later, but mm-hmm. um, just even watching that game, I just have a blast playing it. Like, I watch um, Maximilian Dude and his friends play it. Yeah. And they'll either all be in the same place like we used to do with Overwatch from time to time, or they'll um, stream from their own places. Yeah. And just the four of them going at it, whether they do well or whether they do shit, it's it's fun. And like you mentioned, the call-outs. Like, they have this drone now that can, like, tag people. Mm. So, one guy, if they find a drone, he'll yeah, usually like tag. Apex now, too. Oh, they do? Okay. Mm-hmm. And, um, yeah, then the Max usually is the one who does the best, but you just seeing him, like, work around, like, there was one match he had maybe last week where he grappled up to a building and then in air turned and, bah, 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 like, took care of that guy. I'm like, okay. <laughs> That's absurd. <laughs> Some yeah. reason, yeah, he just got the hang of it. 
Um, I remember my friend at college really loved Blackout. I don't know why I never got into it. Yeah. Yeah. Um, there's other game modes in Blackout now, too, like different slight variations. I'm not sure if you knew about it or ever played them, but, like, um, they have one... I don't know if it's a zombie map, but it's like a small island more, so it's more fast-paced. And if you have a squad, you can redeploy after, like, every 30 seconds or so many, how much, however much time. And then there's another one called Hot Pursuit, which is the original map, but mm-hmm. there's, like, cop cars, like, cop vans, and, like, more race cars and huh. stuff like that. And you can go around. They had a limited time mode where there was, like, swords involved, so Jesus. one player could be a samurai just, ah! <laughs> like, chase after you. So that might, I don't know if that would spice it up for you or get in your Yeah, no, that is interested. cool. I, think, I like that idea. And I always liked the, the game modes that they did in Fortnite as well. Mm-hmm. I remember, like, the the all gold one was fun just mm-hmm. because it would be pure mayhem and everybody yeah. you met was, like, they were all fearful out there. You just, if somebody had, like, a gold rock launcher, you just knew, like, things were going to get dicey. <laughs> uh, that was fun. I, the snipers only was always fun, too, if, if I was sniping good that day. If I was missing everything, I would just get pissed. Right, right. But... And also, I could say it was snipers and revolvers, too, wasn't it? I think so, yeah. yeah. So then, because I know they did a snipers only one once as well, but then they did, like, the Wild West snipers mm-hmm. and uh, revolvers. And whipping the revolver out, because it's such a shit gun, but you get a nice <laughs> kill with it, it was, it was cool. Yeah. yeah. I remember, yeah, I was I was into it for a while. Mm-hmm. But just gets faded out, I guess. Yeah. Right. Do you ever think you'd try it again, or no? Um, I'd probably try Blackout beforehand. Okay. I have no space to download it. Right, that, but yeah. Because I always, I don't know, just because I'm in the COD mood more. Mm-hmm. So as of late. I hear you. Yeah. I hear you. But I do, because like the whole, they did a lot of new stuff with Fortnite. I haven't been on in a while. So. Yeah. It's always cool to pop in there every now and again. I know when they did the Avengers events, I would always get it back down that was and fun. play it again. The Infinity Stone one was fun where you're fighting the mutants. Mm-hmm. That, that mm-hmm. one was a blast. Yeah. That one was a blast. Yeah, and they added uh, lightsabers for Star Wars. That yep, was pretty fun. I saw that. I that didn't get fun. I didn't download it or anything, but mm-hmm. I, did, I did see that. Yeah, they keep up with their times well. They, yeah. It's good. They're smart. Yeah. They're way behind on this next season, but that's whatever. <laughs> They're like three, four weeks over, and Kate and I are just like, come on! <laughs> we don't need more challenges for XP. We're already like 100, 200. It's like, fuck. Mm-hmm. That's another thing, too, that I love that they improved in Fortnite. Kills mean something. Oh, now. I saw that. I yes. saw it was, uh, a play a playthrough of it. We finally get XP for kills. We finally get XP for assists. I'm like, mm-hmm. thank you, <laughs> fucking doing things. There'd be matches in the redeploy mode where I'd get twenty plus kills, and it's like, oh, you get this like one thousand XP. Fuck you. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> yeah, no, I did notice that. Yeah. And it just looks smoother. It looks nicer. Yeah, they put a little a uh, little polish on it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um. And then, yeah, going back to Apex, like, that one was one I really, really enjoyed. And I've totally missed... Season David. 4 now. Yeah, they just released a trailer for it, and that character looks interesting. Mm-hmm. Um, the last time I played was, like, right as the second, or the first girl, the, like, Eskimo-looking chick. Watson? Yeah. Thank you. Came out, like... And then I haven't played since. I didn't play the yeah, tech I, guy. And... I think that's the exact same time I stopped, too, was mm-hmm. when, the, when the Eskimo girl. I loved Octane, though. He was blessed. Oh, yeah. Yep. The first new guy they had, he was a speed demon little bitch. Yeah. I would use him a lot. Mm-hmm. He was fun. Yeah, that was a game I just liked. And I should play that more, because, I mean, I played that a lot solo and not, like, chatting with anybody mm-hmm. or whatever. Um, so, yeah, I think I need to dive into that more. And, like, if you you wanted to play it again and Dio wanted to play it again or you yeah. know, John wanted to give it a try. I That's a John's fun game. <laughs> a stickler John. against Battle Royales, it seems. But, yeah, that, that was... That a, was a stickler against video games. It seems it. Nah, it's all right. <laughs> um, but, yeah. He hates Overwatch, though. God forbid. Yeah, R.I.P. Genji. <laughs> R.I.P. Genji. He was one hell of a Genji. Though. He was. He was. That, was. that was a lot of fun when the four of us were playing that. Yeah. And I wish we could have ever got a six man team going like i know danny dio's friend plays and then we just have to find somebody else but it was a good time a good time, time. we're good at another it game too. yeah it's another game i need to get back to in overwatch i mean we got overwatch 2 coming eventually but yeah we'll see mm-hmm. is there anything 
specific in battle royales that you wish they would change or you think if they did that change that would draw you back into it maybe with fortnite maybe more gun customization okay like, that'd be cool because that's why that's like one of the big things i really love about uh, modern warfare mm -hmm. is that their attachments and uh, unlocks and whatever like there's guns that I use. There's still a gun that I like my most used. I have like two thousand kills with it. And I don't have everything unlocked with it. Wow. They have just so much that you can do with it, and each different gun is different and whatnot. So I think that adds a cool little like difference to it. You know, a little thing you can spice up, mm -hmm. keep it rather keep it in the same, mm -hmm. other than the cosmetics and stuff. All right. Cool. Huh? Well, guys, this has been another episode of the Wait, What Are We Talking About podcast, episode 62. My name is Brett, a.k.a. Enigma9011, and today I was joined by Billy, a.k.a. Hank 82 Billy, thanks for being on the show again. Of course. Appreciate it. I appreciate it. <laughs> if you want to catch this podcast live, you can go over to twitch.tv slash Enigma9011, where it's hosted live, or recorded live, every first and third Saturday of the month, unless it's today mm. and it's pre-recorded. <laughs> um, but you can catch it over there, join on the conversation, hang out with us. We'd love to have you. If you can't catch it live, you can always catch it over on YouTube.com and SoundCloud the following week where it's broken out topic by topic or put as one big video or MP3 for your amusement. And then last but not least, remember, guys, we're brought to you by the merch store. You get all of your swag over there, T-shirts, cups, backpacks, and more. Rep the brand, support us. It would help us out a lot. Billy, thanks for being on. We'll it's have been you a while. on. Yeah, that's <laughs> been a while. I'll probably have you on uh, maybe a little bit more now that you're yeah, more hopefully. local. Yeah. <laughs> hopefully not as uh, as long as a clip as yeah. last time. Yeah. That, yeah, I didn't even put that together until you said that. I was like, shit, yeah, I really mm -hmm. am. A long time. Long time. Long time. I like that new light, too. Oh, me too. Thanks. It was a Christmas present. Oh. Yeah. All right, guys. We will see you guys later. See you guys later. And catch and you on catch the next you one. On the next one. Classic. See ya. <laughs>